Hello YouTube and welcome to another Windows tutorial. So in this video I will show you how you can predict future data using Power BI. This feature is actually called forecasting. So let's get started. So let me open Power BI as you can see here. So here I have imported some data. So if you want to import data to Power BI, it's pretty easy. All you have to do is to go to your file here, menu, import, and you choose, for example, if you have data in your Excel format, you can choose just to export it or to import it from Excel worksheet. Okay. So as you can see here, my data are pretty simple. It's just two columns. One contains the month and the second column contains sales. So I have actually data for two years, for the year 2014 and year 2015, okay? So let's say that we want to predict future data for the year 2016. So in order to do that, it's pretty easy with Power BI. So I will go to my report here, okay? So let's draw just a line chart, okay? Here we go, so I'll choose the month and cells. So let me make it bigger. So here, I will just uh, get rid of quarter and day, and I will keep just the month. Here we go, I have now a clear view for each month. Okay, so now I have represented my data in line chart. So as you can see here, I have the fluctuation for the years 2015 and 2014. So let's say that we want to forecast data for the year 2016. So in order to do that, it's pretty easy. You select your graph and you go here to, you click on the icon actually called analytics. Okay, so I'll click on it and at the bottom you see here option called forecast so I'll click on it and all I have to do is just to add forecast so let's say forecast for the year 2016 for example I will call it just like that and here by default it will forecast for the 10 points so here as you can see in my graph each point represent actually a month so i want to predict for the year 2016 so i will choose 10 or 12 months here we go so i'll hit apply and seasonality here is very important so year contains 12 months so i will just make it 12 and here we go now you can see that they have a relatively accurate approximation of the sales for the year 2016 okay with here with the line in black I can also just to see if my model is accurate to ignore the last for example four months that I have the data for and see if my model predict the data very accurately so I will apply so here you can see that my model works very good because the lines actually match, almost match. So the black is actually the prediction and the green lines are the real data. So here you can see that my model actually work perfectly because the graphics are pretty similar. Okay. So with this beautiful actually options in Power BI, we can predict future data just using some graphics and Power BI. As always, I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing. Bye-bye.